Welcome to our video on how to make this 3D part. First we will make this L shape. Second hole. Material addition with additive cylinder. Material removal with subtractive cylinder. Let's start activity. Select Part Design Workbench. Click here to add a new document. Add Body, Add Sketch. Select XZ Plane. Turn on Grid. Adjust Size. Turn off Auto Constraints. Select Polyline Tool. Draw Rough Sketch. Select Horizontal Constraint Provide Vertical Constraint Provide Horizontal Constraint Provide Length Provide coincident constraint to lock planner movements. You can see fully constrained sketch. Close this sketch. Use pad tool to extrude this sketch. Select Subtractive Cylinder to remove material. Provide Height and Radius. Select Reference Plane Calculate Offset from Reference and Provide Distance You can use Expression Tool Click OK to Execute Select Edge to provide fillet. Click on Task. Click here. Provide Radius. Click OK. Add material by selecting Additive Cylinder. Provide radius and height. Check height. Select reference plane. Adjust Cylinder Location Click OK to execute
Select Subtractive Cylinder to remove material. Provide Radius and Height. Select Reference Plane. Offset Cylinder. Click OK to execute. And there you have it. By following along and analyzing the isometric view, you've successfully recreated this part. Well done. Let's export this part. Import this part. Move this part. Change body color. Remember, practice makes perfect and with time, you'll develop the skills to tackle, even more challenging designs. Keep exploring, experimenting, and pushing the boundaries of your creativity.